In reality, there are some people who are selfless and put others before themselves. Then there are the not-so-selfless people who are always, well, put themselves before others. Did you know that is actually a type of mental disorder? It is called narcissistic personality disorder. So what exactly is this disorder? Well, there are five traits to it. One, they have a constant sense of self-importance. Now, some may mistake this to be on the same level as arrogance. However, that is not true. Self-importance means the person believes they are special or are above average. They will often think of themselves ab above others and as a result will believe they deserve such recognition to their demand. 2. Lives in a fantasy that supports their delusions. Now look, it is okay to make your own little multiverse with a story and collab with your friends. So long as you aren't obsessed with it and you only do it for fun. However, making a fantasy that supports your desires and choices simply because reality does not support it is a different story. The most common thing you would find in a narcissist's world is a shield to protect them from shame and criticism. 3. Demands constant praise and admiration. The title is very self-explanatory in this one. Narcissists will require an infinite supply of compliments in order to function. Generally speaking, reality doesn't work like that. They will want that praise and they will want those followers. The reason why they do this? Well, seeing that narcissists have the sense of self-importance, it would only make sense for them to want that praise too. 4. Having a need of entitlement. That's right, these people think they have some special kind of right to do so and stuff, as far as the definition of entitlement goes. However, self-entitlement fits the description more. This means you think you would deserve a certain privilege of sorts, like they believe reality owes them or something and are in need of a reward, sometimes with little or no given reason. 5. Exploits others without shame. Exploiting is basically when one person uses and takes advantage of another person by either using their work, their idea, or them in a literal sense. People can exploit for many reasons, and narcissism fits into that category as well. They go over other people because, once again, they think they are above everyone else. So now let's check out some of the cases related to this disorder. One case study was about a woman named Jenna Maroney. Jenna often lived a difficult life in her teen years, which led her to become self-centered to cope with her difficulties. According to her case study, it says that she often did not have feelings towards others and was quite lonely. The strongest piece of evidence, however, was that she was known for having a large pattern of grandiosity. A narcissist will rarely seek treatment because they think they are so good. In the end, however, it was not specified whether or not she got the right help, but safe to say that the narcissism is still there. So, the category this mental illness falls in is really just a mood. The symptoms usually include just them being full of themselves, often being arrogant, and generally not taking criticism very well. According to the statistics, 54.86% of narcissism cases are women and 45% were men. Usually the main case of this is either from a suicide attempt, psychotic episodes, or cases admitted for suicide attempt but were not really frequently treated. Treatments for narcissism personality disorder usually come from therapy, but they also sometimes encourage you to reflect on yourself, like recognize and accept your actual competence and potential so you can tolerate criticisms. <sighs> to conclude, narcissistic personality disorder is a mental illness where a certain person will be full of themselves, themselves, and of course, themselves. They choose to live their own universe without consequences and to some extent don't mind exploiting or putting down others. Their self-importance mindset is the reason why they don't choose to get the right treatment because, well, they don't think they should.